Hello folks and welcome to Gaz's Adventures in No Clip. Yay, let's go no clipping. Basically I thought I'd make this video because I found something pretty cool out. Um and some of you may know about it, some of you may not, and um yes, so I'll let you know. Right, basically it's to do with the uh you know, kind of the sky generation. Um because that is just that is just like a, a sphere almost. Um a lot of the times in 3D things it's called a sky dome and basically you know that's like a sphere that's going around the whole map um, that's centered to where you are hence why it doesn't move when you walk um, however let's go into no clip mode uh, by the way if you want to go into no clip I'm sure most of you have uh, in a in a in a uh, source game go into options keyboard advanced and then enable developer console and you should get to it with the tilde button I think it's called or the straight line button on my keyboard uh, type in no clip press enter you won't get really a response then when you come out you'll be able to fly now basically on a lot of the, the maps you'll see can you see the buildings kind of that are not attached to anything they're almost in the sky um, but they're obviously not attached to the thing so when you're moving around as you can see they move as well they are actually 3D objects now when you go too high the sky stops displaying uh, now on one of the other maps I went through the floor and noticed a light area and thought wow I wonder what that is and went down and it turned out to be these 3D objects so I thought that's pretty cool now as you can see in this map when you go under you can see them if we keep flying right up right up there we go look here are the items that will display now they're displaying again down there sometimes it goes a bit funny so you'll have to kind of let your eyes adjust and whatever as you can see these are exact replicas it's almost like there's a camera up here um, and this is where it generates this, the uh, kind of foregroundy background objects if you get what I mean the ob the actual 3d objects so um, I thought if it's doing that to create these objects that you can see uh, I wonder if you can add stuff in that area because it's just part of the map it's just kind of a hidden part so I in the other map I'll show you what I did um, we'll choose so let's see what's going to be easy to pick out. We'll choose this kind of flat building on its own, and we will get. Um, what shall we get? Uh, let's use let's use a turret. Where's the turret gone? Oh no! Oh, it's there. No, it's not. Ah, it's here. There, there is a floor, by the way, as well, which you can't see very well. So, oh, now this turret seems to already be no clipped. You may have to no clip. Um, items. So, for example, I'll put him sticking out of that building there. Um, and you know what? Why not? Let's um, let's put an emitter on there as well. Um, of smoke. I don't know where that's gone. Oh, it's there. Oh, I can't get it. I can't get it. Why can't I get it? Okay. It's uh, difficult to grab all the stuff in this world. So, what you might want to do is kind of spawn oh there we go spawn things in the uh, in the normal world and then um, duplicate them into this world so I'll leave that there and if I press what was it that button there we go so now we've got smoke oh and we've got another oh as you can see you can see it there so if I jump out of the sky and come down here and in fact what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, Gonna no clip out there. So here I am walking around the level as you normally would. And whoa, look at all that smoke coming up there. Whoa, where's that coming from? Let's go and investigate. And I don't know this map, so you may not see it. Now unfortunately I didn't choose something on the map that we can see very well. So uh let's go back and change it. That was a bad example. I apologise. But there we go. If I hover, you can actually see it there uh, in our fake sky, which is actually up here somewhere. Uh, if I turn the emitter off, that didn't work. How about that? Has that worked? Yes. Um, let's get rid of the emitter. Uh, I'll move it to, I think, that building there. We, we can see. Let's just have it there. In fact, what we could do we could have it like this uh, let's get some rope let's use the good old um, yeah let's use the laser rope yeah let's make it 
let's make it a bit thicker I don't know why then we'll shoot that there and then there we go it can just shoot something out the sky so it's a moment of truth can we see it from there oh my yes we can how awesome does that look it looks like we're being attacked by turrets so of course I'll the no clip uh, I've no right make sure you're near the floor when you no clip again so that it can actually let you drop now you can just about see it um, if we stand here there we go um, that's actually the and of course that moves in 3d space with you um, as you saw you can put emitters there you can put ragdolls there you can put anything you can in tf2 you can even you know make something that rotates and spins around and um, yeah and it will appear relevant to to where uh, now this is this is only really the second map I've tried it on um, so I'm guessing if it's a source game uh, a lot of maps use this technique especially to put these foreground items in if you get a map that just has sky chances are there won't be an area or they might be but it'll be hard to find but if you if you basically no clip and fly around outside the map when it when it goes black when it doesn't display the sky um, you should see an area and, and you might have to fly a while to get to it um, but chances are it's going to be the 3d outer buildings that you can see all around um, and yeah then you can just put random stuff in so this is awesome for like machinima makers who might want awesome stuff in the background or you know you want to make it look like there's explosions going on really far away you do actually have more to play around with uh, and I thought that was pretty cool um, so <laughs> that was uh, quite brief but uh, I hope you enjoyed it and this was my adventures in Noclip thanks for watching goodbye